Ski season is off to a great start when it comes to snow, but at one resort, not so great when it comes to parking. So right in the middle of the ski season, Eldora up in Boulder County will start charging for parking on certain days. Denver 7's Thomas Hoppo has how much it's going to cost you. One of the best perks about coming out to Eldora is that you don't have to pay for parking. You can see that it is pretty packed right now. We'll come next weekend. All of that is going to change. We're at Eldora. Uh, I try to get up here at least 10 times a year. A lot of things have changed this year in Eldora. I would say it's probably busier. We'll see about, you know, a big day for us is maybe 5,000 or so people on snow. In fact, so busy, things are a bit congested. <laughs> right here. In the parking lot. Look at that door. <laughs> Look, it's hardly... It's almost touching. Even though parking is tight, skiers love it because... I don't have to pay, no. No, no, there's no need to pay. Well, now may be the time for that need. Sunday after Thanksgiving, we had to turn away more than 200 cars. Um, by some estimates, it was closer to 300. Eldora did a study and found out that their cars that came to their park had an average of 1.7 passengers. And to help cut down on cars in the lot, they came up with a solution for parking Friday through Sunday. Every car arriving with three or more people will be free. Cars arriving with two or fewer people will be charged $20 to park. Wow. Wow, I'll take the bus. <laughs> that makes it uh, more inconvenient if you're trying to do a, a quick trip just solo. All this will start December 15th until the end of the season in April. Those parking kiosks are already here. But Eldora's end game is just to get less cars in the lot and more people on the slopes. We hope it doesn't turn people away. We hope it convinces people to carpool, ride share, arrive with three or more, be creative, find ways to avoid that fee. We hope we don't collect a single parking fee. Now, today is the last day that people did not have to pay for parking. So coming next weekend, that's going to change. You need to plan accordingly. If there's only two of you in the car, you're going to have to pay for parking. So plan to have three or more if you make your way out here or take the bus. Reporting in Eldora, Thomas Hoppo, Denver 7. See if that affects the crowds. Thank you, Thomas.